Hi, this is Ken from the Urban Shooter Podcast, and I'm at Nova Armament. We're going to talk about the 870P shotgun today. Malcolm, welcome to the Urban Shooter, man. Hey, Ken, how you doing today? Man, thanks for this. Tell me about this shotgun. Well, this is a Remington 870 Police Magnum shotgun. Uh, the reason they call it Police Magnum is because it is rated for both 2 and 3 quarter and 3 inch shells. Right. And as a police shotgun, it goes through additional quality controls at Remington to make sure it'll never fail if you know, you're depending your life upon it. Right. It's a 12 gauge shotgun. It's got an 18 inch barrel with a bead sight. Holds four rounds in the magazine plus one in the chamber for a total of five. Your controls are a safety right here, mm -hmm. which can be reversed for a left-handed shooter. You've also got your bolt release right here, your trigger, and there's your forend, and that's how the gun functions. Real simple. Very, very easy. With something like this, you load your shells into the loading port here, cycle your action, and the gun would now be loaded and ready to fire once you had a target and took your safety off. One thing I've noticed is that this one is just totally all blacked out, and usually they have um, like a wood stock, and this part is wood. What's the difference of this one here? Well, um, because it's a police shotgun, you figure it's going to be in bad conditions. It's going to get banged around in the squad car. It's going to be out in the rain. So a synthetic stock is much more durable than a wood stock. It won't shrink over time. It won't splinter. It's much harder to break this. Uh, also, you've got the parkerized finish on the gun, which is much more rust resistant than the traditional bluing. So it just makes it more durable, um, more likely to stay serviceable for a longer period of time. More practical than tactical. Definitely. All right, man. Think, what's this little, little nib right here? This is the magazine cap. Um, what this does is when you're going to take the gun apart to clean it, if you unscrew this, mm -hmm. it comes off and allows you to remove the barrel. So now the gun can be disassembled for cleaning. Oh, wow. You can remove the forend. That was easy. Yeah, you drive out the two pins, your whole trigger assembly comes out, and you can completely clean it. And then, very simple, put it back together. And then you're ready to go for your next rain session, hunting trip, or you know, put it back in the closet for home defense. Oh man, awesome. So this was the Remington A70P police shotgun. Yes, sir. All right, man, thank you so much. You're welcome.